Well, while we're here, we gotta have some coffee. And the cinnamon roll looked awesome. Here's to webcam photo number 73. <laughs> Another adventure starts right here in northern Washington with a webcam and of course coffee and a cinnamon roll at the Spruce Goose Cafe. Kind of hard to tell it's us we're that blob and we're standing kind of in front of our Tesla rental but that's webcam number 73 for me and just a couple less for Lyric Glass. Boom! Another adventure coming up. So from that webcam, we stopped in uh, along the route to charge our Tesla. And we have a guest. Yes, we're meeting a friend from YouTube. Hey, hey guys. Oh hey. my gosh, it's Geo Jerry. It's great to see you, Geo Jerry. How are you doing? Doing great. Cool to really meet you in person. Hey, you too. Yeah, yeah this is awesome. Fantastic. Hey, if you haven't checked out his channel, look it up. Um, yeah, just, uh, just right over here. Check it out. <laughs> this is awesome. And you've done this geocache before? I have. Yeah. yeah. So let's go look at it. All right, let's go. Oh, look, it's right here. Ah, uh, got it. We got the first stage. Now we have to use the Dewey Decimal System. Hmm, huh. does anybody remember that? Uh, and to go find the cache inside the library. Oh. The author is Cash. Oh. And it's the good hunt. Oh. G O Cash. <laughs> Three Peaks Geocache. Well, that was pretty cool. That was a fun one. I yeah. really enjoyed that. And the binding on the book was, it was awesome. very fun. And you said you had first to find on that one? I did. I did. Oh. Four years ago. Was that? Well done. Oh, a number of years ago. Yeah. 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 Well, cool. It's, uh, it was so cool to bump into you on our travels. We had to stop and say hello. Yeah, and, uh, I'm glad you did. Yeah, we're on our way to the original stash cache. And that's a good one. Is that hard to find? No. Oh, good. <laughs> <laughs> All right, yeah. make sure you check out his channel and uh, we'll say we're on our way. I like Cash Canada. All right, see ya. See ya. Bye bye. Holy doodle, doodle. He's, he's big. big. That's Paul. Bunyan. Woohoo. Well, that's really cool, Jerry. Thanks for bringing us here. <laughs> yeah. And this geocache was, was put out by the Supernauts. The Supernauts, another geo vlogging couple right there. Check them out. Pretty cool. <laughs> So we've added another virtual to our list. Yeah. Hey, guess what? This is our first geocache. In Oregon. Woohoo! Amazing. We get a new souvenir. And this guy is a souvenir for us too. Woohoo! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> and then boom, just like that, we're at the webcam cache. We're on our way, let's go. Yeah. Oh, gotta cross the street. There's the window. There we are. Right there. Look. There we are. Ooh. Wow, look at that. So another webcam cache here at the tavern in Portland, Oregon. And that's all you gotta do is walk up to this tavern's front door, and then you'll get yourself in the image, capture that, post it, and you got a webcam. It's that simple. Sometimes it's not that simple, but this one is that simple. Boom, and just like that, we're at another webcam, and it's not gonna be the last. And an Australian geocacher showed up, G-Ridge 98. Hey guys, how are you? Oh, it's awesome to share this image with you yeah. and get in there and talk to you about geocaching. And you're here for the Geo Woodstock, Woodstock yeah. and the 2020 celebration. That is yeah. so awesome. You're looking forward to seeing it? And yeah, it'd be really good to meet some new people from all around the world and awesome. catch up and yeah. get some good... And you'll come and see us again. We're right yeah. smack dab in the middle of all the... All the uh, vendors and shit and stuff like that that's yeah. pretty cool so yeah looking forward to it another webcam number 75 for me Woohoo! well done yeah that's only number seven for me so yeah, yeah. cool I'm keep, catching up. keep at it you got to go to germany yeah you got to go to yeah. germany to get webcams you, yeah and we're going in 2024 looking awesome. forward to that
and we're at another webcam. This is a really hard one to figure out. I really enjoyed searching for it because there are 1,300 and something highway webcams you have to search through to find this very spot. The problem is, it's really hard to tell if you're in it. I mean, here's our screenshot, and we circled where we are with my blue shirt, but boy, is it hard to tell. It was 412, we, we got here at 410. So 412, we're in the screenshot, but huh, who knows? You just gotta take it with a word of a grain of salt or take it on a little bit of faith that that's us. Anyway, another webcam. To figure out which webcam that was, there are certain telltale markers to look for. One is the MS, MOS uh, graffiti on the wall right that there. That was a big help. Yeah, to look for that, you look for the Google Street View from the highway to determine whether you're on the right spot. And then to figure out, uh, actually the coordinates for the webcam are the next bridge down at the X mark. But that's not where you need to stand according to the picture that's on the web page. That was a two and a half one uh, webcam, so it's a little bit more difficult. And I'd liked that as a challenge to figure out which one it was. It wasn't just because when you click on the link to the webcam, it gives you pages and pages of like 1500 webcams, and you have to figure out which one so you we need. Had to search through them all to, to find it. Yeah. It was a little frustrating at first, and then I've wait, I had a sudden shout of just like finding a geocache. I got it! Yep. <laughs> so on to the next. Some of these webcams aren't easy. It's not just a matter of going to the posted coordinates. You got to figure out what are the posted coordinates. <laughs> and how to find the and how to find the camera. Yeah. So you find the camera, and then okay, where where is it looking? What is it looking at? And uh, just to get there and how to get there. So uh, we finally found this next one. It was not easy. And then find a place to park and then get there, get in the image, and then capture the image. That one, I don't know, is really hard to see. We can see the, the crane down there in the image, but us, it's like a white blob with her shirt. That, it's, that, it's just like so hard to see. And, uh, and there's a lot of construction here and we're walking on the plastic on stones, it's really weird. So just like before, we held up our Cache Canada banner and you can just see it with my blue shirt on the very far right of the picture. So we're there, we got it, another one done. And there's another webcam in uh, Clinton, Washington. And that was uh, green. That was pretty simple. It's green light, we gotta go. Oh, we're really small. <laughs> we're tiny. <laughs> That's good right there. Uh, yeah, it's kind of, you can't even see that. You can't even see the sign there, except it's a white blob. <laughs> we'll take a picture of it. Snap in the picture. Sure there is. Guys. Oh yeah? There's a rainbow. So the rainbow, oh, my basically, God. and I'm going to die. Do you want me to send this yes, to you? Please. Oh, that'd be fabulous. Oh, that's beautiful. Thank, Thank you. you. Yeah. So I, need to, I need to find that mark. So uh, yeah. Well, there you go. Woohoo! That's pretty awesome. Lots of webcams around. Yeah. We love webcam caches, and that was the number one target for our trip out here to Geo Woodstock and... Seattle. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> because uh, it's something we've just been working on, and I'm so happy to finally be able to get some more webcams, mm -hmm. because we haven't been able to travel to the States. Now it's open season. There yep. we go. Cool. We'll be getting more. Yep. So keep watching, because there's more caches to be found. Yep. Where will geocaching take you? Take you.